Great Tibetians, this is me once again, aka Optimist Amechi. And uh, this morning is just to remind you that we are getting there. We are steadily moving forward with what is happening around. It shows that, yes, the steady progress of what we are doing is what we are seeing. And we are not in any way trying to hang our boots on the wrong places. No, we are not in any way trying to cajole you into something else. But rather, we are always trying to make sure that whatever is happening here, whatever we are saying here, is actually the way they are. And that is exactly what we witnessed yesterday in TBC mass adoption training with the TBC admin. If you listen very well, you understand that there are many scammers in the community using TBC steadily to scam people, using TBC to take away what does not belong to them, leaving those people in confusion. And that serves or that may serve them well because those people don't care to listen and then come to the meeting and get proper education. There are many scammers out there, but we are not depending on scammers. We are focusing on what we have. Even <clears throat> other established currencies out there also have scammers trying to scam people. In fact, scamming people big time. So TBC is no different. But the different thing here is that we are always steadily getting people exposed, you know, warning people not to fall for scams. And that is our difference. We have strong support in TBC 247. As you can see, we have this support system here that you cannot compare this with any other uh, community. So basically what I want us to see today is this. is a reminder, just as I have been steadily reminding you from time to time, that we should make sure that our send button test is complete. We should also make sure that we are not going about carrying wrong information or wrong understanding going about. Sometimes if something is not clear to you, it is better you ask a leader. It may surprise you that even I, the one speaking to you now, when something is not clear to me, I usually run to those people I know that can be able to clarify me. Okay? Not too long ago, this morning, I was asking uh, the ambassador, Embe Derek, of one particular issue that I'm not getting proper clarification on. And uh, that is just the way it goes because everything we do in this very community is very plain. Why do I say that? Look at it here. Part of the question, send button test questions that we need to take. Look at, I think this is the number 10 of it. Say, it shouldn't matter if I you, whoever, choose to express a negative opinion in a public forum, I have a right to do so. Is it correct? Now, we have two options. Number one says incorrect. Why? Your negativity expressed openly in public, such as on Facebook, not only jeopardizes your purchase of TBC coins and their value, but it brings harm to the entire TBC community. And the best place to share your negative, negative opinion is with a TBC leader privately so that it has the opportunity of becoming resolved for you and all. You know, when you carry a negative opinion or something you don't understand clearly, you, 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 you take it outside and expose it openly, you will end up causing harm, unnecessary harm, to you and the entire community. Or that we just pick it up and then off they go with it. But here we are discouraging that. Okay? Even families, different families have their secrecy. Different families have their the, the things they don't, yes, they are not doing anything bad, but they have things that they don't need to share with the public. Okay? So if you have issue you that you don't understand, come and then have it properly uh, corrected. Okay? So, here is another point we are reminding people of the need to keep the account activated. But even if your account is expired, we are not holding you, you must renew your account. No, this is optional, completely optional. But the only thing we are talking about now is this. If 
you haven't taken your send button test, that is where you are committing something wrong. Why? Because whether or not your account is expired, you equally have the option, the ability, okay, to complete your same button test. That is your KYC, so to say. And how do you do that? It's very easy. You just come here because whenever you come here, you are going to see this uh, reminder in yellow. If you, are, if you have not done it properly, or if you have, if you have not done it at all, you are going to see the reminder in yellow. Say, what next? What to do next? Click here to complete your send button test. Just click here in the, yeah, in, in, in the blue color there. Just click there to complete your send button test. And that is just as easy as that. So people are being reminded steadily for them to do this. A quick one again is what I want to show you now about uh, something important in the community. Now, let me go through the menu and show you this. I come to marketing. Uh, I go to core team. Okay? Now, as it opens, if you look very well, if you were in the meeting yesterday, you are going to see that the number that we had here was almost 11,000, even getting to 12,000. But how come we are having now, instead of going up, we are having 10,000 976, there is still about 135 more to round up the core team properly. Why is that the case? This is part of the things that when you see it and it's not clear to you, you don't start shouting. You don't start making noise. Don't start saying, hey, look at, we said it. TBC admin is a cheat. TBC admin is this, this that, that, that. No. No. When you come to understand, see something like this, you go and ask questions. You go and try to understand why is that the case. I will talk more on this later, but let me just show you something here. Very soon now, once this number completes here, you look at here, once you come here, you'll be able to know who belongs to where and so on and so forth. You can see active members. You can see backup. So when you click them here, you'll be able to see, okay, this place is this, this person is here, the other person is here. And it's going to be a continuous fight now because just like admin said in a blog post, look at what the admin said. And I'm seeing this playing out. I'm seeing this playing out, playing out big time. <laughs> Let me just open it. Now, look at it here. Look at what ad the TBC admin said in a post. I say, funny. How so many need to learn the hard way? They need to learn the hard way. I still see so many Tibetans falling off the core team every day. I predict that the first 5,000 on the backup team will eventually end up on the core team by TBC admin. <laughs> this prediction may be right, this prediction may be wrong. The only thing there is that admin has spoken. With experience, he has spoken because of the attitude of people. Now, can you now put this together with what we are having here? Yesterday, we were having over 11,000 here, 11,500 or thereabout. But how many are you having here? People are falling on steadily. So in case you don't understand here, Good and fine. The ambassador here in Nigeria, Austin, made a voice note with regards to that. So let me just quickly see if I can uh, have access to that very voice note. You also listen to it and get some clarification. Pay attention and listen to that. Hello, greetings, Alf, and um, a very good morning to each and every one of you. Trust we all had a wonderful night. 
and um, welcome to a new day. Today is um, 21st of um, June 2022 and um, I want to just make a very quick one. Yesterday I made the feedback as regards um, our court team filling out and um, we had an overflow yesterday. We had about 11,100 and um, I think 170 something. I can't actually recall exactly what number. <clears throat> but then, you know, some people thought, including myself, the administration and what have you, that the court team had been filled out. But really, you know, based on the principle of meritocracy, the principle of meritocracy is very simple. It means fulfill the conditions to be on that team, and that's it. And um, the most, you know, recognized, you know, level are the core team, following, followed by the backup team and the mass adoption team. These three categories, as it is being filled out, the condition that applies to the core team will apply to the mass adoption team and the backup team. So here, we had him very clear. He was just trying to shed more light as to the reason why the number we had here yesterday is no longer what we are having now here. What does that imply? You don't build a strong structure on the, uh, uh, under maybe on an empty space you have to make sure that your foundation is very strong, is solidly laid. And that is what we are seeing playing out here. Okay? If admin should say, oh, this thing did not actually happen the way we saw it yesterday and uh, the people we saw there yesterday are no longer there today. Okay, let's just go ahead and do that. If he is to do that, that means he is still going to be the one to look for how to measure it up again. Admin is not trying to cajole anybody. And that is one of the topics he raised yesterday. Okay? We don't have to tell people what is not true just because we want to sell TBC to them. We want to sell the idea of TBC to them. We want them to register. No. Those people who are not committed to doing something great, to doing something uh, authentic, will not join you in TBC. I met somebody whom I helped to make program fee because the person was not active. Someone who paid under her, actually paid for annual program fee. And she just paid one month and got about 110,000 naira here in Nigeria. Do you know, due to her, her reasoning, <laughs> and these are the people we call the old leaders in TBC. She just said, okay, ah, I just... Spend about twenty something thousand naira and I got over one hundred and ten thousand. Okay, this money I got now. She started using it to register. I mean, to activate people under her. Uh -huh. So if I activate this, I'm going to get one hundred and ten thousand. So people like that are these people going to stay put? By the time she realized that no, that the reason why she got one hundred and ten thousand was because the person actually paid for annual uh, made annual payment. That if it is monthly. What she's going to get there is about fifteen dollars or thereabout. So people like that, if they come in and then think that hey, this is the way UP members are kind of, are we going to build our foundation based on such kind of people? No, is the answer. So those people who will be in the core team and the backup team are strong members, and they are the one to make sure that the economy of what we are building is solid. So. Don't go about following the people who are just out there for their stomach, for their belly. No. Here is a strong community, and we are always trying to make it stand out clear. If you have any confusion that you don't understand, as the leaders, if you have something you want to get clarification on, you can come here under the education section and then go to private blog and see it lay bare. Okay? We are already assuming that the... the, the, the Core team is because we just have about 135. Just before the day runs out, I'm, I'm sure it's going to complete. So, the next thing is that we should build the backup team quickly. We already have the numbers, okay? We already have the numbers here. Just like when you look at the, the number currently here, you continue to see 
about 3 million plus. It's just a question of getting these numbers activated, getting these numbers to see what is happening. Let people understand that we are not joking. The idea of TBC may not be making sense to some people, but those who really understand how this abundance-based economy was, we actually jump into it. So stop wasting time listening to those who will rather discourage you or pull you down, but pay attention to those who are ready to work with you. Pay attention to those who are ready to make sure that what we are doing actually stand tall. We appreciate TBC admin. We appreciate the hardworking ambassadors around the world. We appreciate all the members of TBC who are ready to push along with us because we are not joking. We are not playing. Rather, we are building a solid economy. People, in case you don't understand, so much is still coming on board. It's only those that wait. It's only those that have the ability to wait and stay put. That the patient wants, they are going to see the wonders of TBC. It's already happening. So, let us do it and get it done right. This is me, A.K. Optimist Amici. Thank you once again.